And the other thing that I should mention about these pipes, and I know I've had to put it on another clip, but uh, unfortunately for the web space I'm actually going to be using, I've only got a certain amount of time that I can actually uh, use um, f for a video clip. Um, Bob Essex is a, 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 a very knowledgeable gentleman, I'm sure most of you know him out there. Um, he's actually proof these pipes, probably not realising what I'm doing with it, uh, but he's actually uh, seen uh, part of the plans for these about two years ago when I first started uh, looking into building my own. A very knowledgeable guy and I wish to thank him very much. Um, these pipes here, um, he has actually seen them in a different form. Um, but uh, I'm a little monkey for doing things like that. I show people things in one variant just to pick the brain um, to see and then discuss the variant I want to do to the pipe to see what the idea, what, what the think is. And um, this is what I come up with anyway, these pipes. And uh, Bob, probably unknowing to uh, Bob, um, who I do phone quite regular and pick his brains and he's, a, same as I've said, a very knowledgeable guy. And I just wish to take this opportunity to say thank you, Bob, uh, for all your help. That might put a little bit of um, picture on who I actually am. Um, I ate my picture on, on video, hence the reason why you've not seen me. Um, if anybody really needs to see me, I will put a photo up, but only on massive request. Thanks. Thanks again, Bob. Maybe another gentleman I should um, mention, um, uh, John Smith quite good friends, I think I've mentioned it before in the other video clips, uh, well at least I hope he's still friends with me. Um, anyway, um, most of you probably know me, I actually um, run the AOB uh, website, Amateur Organ Builders Groups, the AOBG.co.uk, um, and I also run the forum that's attached to that, that's the Amateur Organ Builders Group Forum. So most of you now know why I'm the cats out the bag. Um, I'd like to just say thanks to John. Um, I have bought all his plans over the years and he's actually gave me quite a few of them as well. Um, he's, he's, a, he's a great gentleman, full of ideas. Um, I never actually got round to building any of um, John's organs. I'm sure I will in the future. Uh, it's just that I decided the way for me to go forward and to learn more about it was just to start from scratch and, and move on. A lot of good pointers John pointed out in some of his organ building and ticks is start with your air supply. Uh, I do know that some of his organ plans you know, start with pipes, um, but the one thing he did learn me, which is quite crucial, is build your air supply first. Uh, don't build your pipes and uh, fix the fronts on and so forth, and then expect the air supply to run them. You really should build the air supply first, uh, and then build your pipes to suit the air supply. Uh, well, that's, you know, uh, the way that I've done this. Otherwise you find that the pipes um, overblow or underblow and don't work correctly and the reason for it, a lot of it is, is because people build the pipes first and then build the air supply. Um, from what I understand in my research and my playing about that is not the way to go. You should always build your air supply first. Once you've got your air supply up and running and, and to what you want um, and then you start building your pipes and that's what I've done. Um, but in saying that, I've now got to change the blower, um, and I'm hoping the one I'm going to be buying from um, our friendly Alan Pell uh, is going to be uh, suitable for the job, but I'm sure it will. I'm hoping he's going to let me take the organ over and actually try one um, to see before I actually buy. Um, I'm sure I can arrange something with Alan, he's quite bendable. Um, great team over there. Uh, I've not actually been over to the factory yet, but... Um, um, I'm open to go over in the next few weeks. Again, thanks to everyone that's um, given any information over the years. Uh, you may have thought it was insignificant, um, but I can assure you if you've given me any information, it ain't insignificant. Um, it all results in uh, helping us all along the ladder of building his own organ. Uh, incidentally, I think I've actually punted this in one of the other videos for you. I will be um, selling these plans, or maybe giving them away. I think giving away is, is, is more the way to go. Um, I don't really, well, money's not important in life is it? So I don't think there's any need to uh, to sell them. I'd like to probably give these ones away but I've got to ask my wife on that because I've spent a hell of a lot of money building this thing. Um, anyway, um, 
I'll now go just to let you know this one is actually going to go in a trailer um, the trailer is three quarters built um, so hopefully it will be out within the next four weeks uh, and there will be video, video and photographs on the website uh, of the trailer being built as well um, my grandson gave me a hand with that he was just turned 16 and he's now getting the bug of the organs uh, he's, he's come to live with us now but anyway uh, enough of my rantings um, I wish to bid you all good day and thanks for coming to my workspace